holiday shopping holiday shopping is beginning hey guys well what is going on with my hair so i picked up a few bits i don't know what is going on with my hair right now honestly guys so a few of the bits i picked up is these two deodorants this is the mitchum powder fresh one and honestly this is the best deodorant i've ever used any other deodorant i've used literally just doesn't smell good or just like doesn't work like it doesn't last this honestly is so good. I sweat quite a bit, which I know probably people are going to be like, ugh. Um, I sweat so much. Um, and these are so good. So I got two. I've got one for now, one to save for holiday. I actually was using another one from this brand, but it actually smelled a bit like weed, which was gross. <laughs> um, so anyways, I am sticking with this now. And I literally paid like a pound something for both of these. And in every other shop I went into, like Tesco's, Boots, Superdrug, they were like three pounds each or two for five pounds, I thought just got myself a bargain there i then picked up some ibuprofen to take as well picked up some toothbrushes new comb for like slicking back my hair because i actually had one of these but i'm pretty sure my sister took it and has lost it and also i just need a new one it's got like the point of it on the end as well so it's really good for like parting i've got some snacks i'm probably gonna end up eating these before i even go but i'm gonna probably take them on my airplane bag and they might last me then also picked up a new micellar water can you believe this is literally six pounds like six pounds and i actually don't even use this properly to take all my makeup i use like cleansing balms but i always go in with this afterwards but this was six pounds and also it's going to take a bit of weight in my case got some cotton pads to go with the micellar water she also about to head to tesco's quick now so i'm going to pick up some snacks more like sweets and chocolates and things for the plane um so i'll show you what i get once i get back so i actually picked up a lot of snacks this is actually for my sister and i chair not just for myself as much as i could probably eat all of this probably not the best of me and um yeah it's just gonna be for me and my sister to share it on the plane and then just like to have snacks with us we got some squashy drumsticks these are the sour cherry and apple ones i actually love these so much um and then the haribo super mix I am obsessed with the jelly babies in here and then these ones on with like the white bottom. We then got some tang fast tang fast sticks. Um, there's so many cherries in here which is so good. And then these chocolate covered pretzels flips. My sister chose these and then I went for some Tony's Chocolonies um bites. This is the caramel and sea salt and biscuit mix. So I'm hoping this is gonna be really nice. I'm gonna pack these. Probably some in my case and then some in like hand luggage. Um, so yeah, that is some of the snacks that we picked up from Tesco's. Guys, please excuse the state of me. I actually do have clothes on, by the way. It literally looks like I'm sat here naked right now. It's Monday and I have just come back to do a bit more packing. Um, so far, I've got basically all my clothes in there. I've got my beach towel, sandals... I actually cleaned a few pairs of my sandals earlier, so they're outside drying. Well, they're probably dry now, I should get them in, but I'll just do it tomorrow. Um, I've got all of my bags, all of my bikinis, um, some phone cases, all of my jewellery. I have started to put some things in my wash bag. So, so far I've got my cellar water, I've got my deodorant, I've got all my Fox Tan products. I've got some Eloise products, so I'm going to do some content and some bits of yeah content while i'm there so i've got those products i need to do my makeup i need to do shampoo conditioner sun creams perfume actually let me get a perfume because i'm going to do some content with that while i'm away as well um i got a scent let me show you it's the calvin klein um ck1 ck1 it just says ck1 and i actually love the smell of it but i don't know what it reminds me of it reminds me a bit of my dad's smell it's like um it's a mix i think i don't know if this is unisex but i love the smell of it so i'm gonna take that one i'm also gonna take a couple of others claw clips and these headbands i'm gonna take as well bought these ones already got of course um ellie may if you want to order that stuff we need to do it right now because i don't even know if it's going to come in time still I have no clue what I'm going to take as like my carry-on shoulder bag. I was going to order one, but it's too late now because it's not going to arrive in time. I might actually pop to town tomorrow maybe to look in um, the only shop that is there. Possible H&M to see if they have any bags. Currently Sunday afternoon, I've literally just got back. 
I have been so busy I literally have not started to pack um so that is my goal today I'm going to try to get everything sorted choose some bits that I've got to take um but I do actually need to put this battery on charge I've got a lot to do before I, I am officially starting to pack so I've kind of got everything out that I need just going through jewelry because I've got actually I bought quite a lot of new jewelry um some of this is old but I got just like some new bangles so I feel like they tend to go well the one I had was like really off coloured so I just got gold and silver um I got this necklace which I was actually going to get last year and then by the time I was going to get it, it just wasn't summer anymore so I thought I'd just get it when I need it so I got this I actually love it so much um these I got a while ago actually from Primark um just in silver because I feel like I have so much gold jewelry and not really a lot of silver this is also another bangle bit more this one is just like open and closed and it's just like that which I thought was actually really nice also had these hoops which is really good because they go really nicely with this bangle like they're kind of like that I think it's like hammered effect I don't know if that's actually what it is but these I got a while ago as well um and I've been wearing them a lot so yeah just jewelry and stuff and I've got it all in this little bag this is like a beach bag well not a beach bag more of like a clutch you can actually unclip this bit so you could just have it like as a little clutch or you've got the little like handle to, bit to hold it as well so i'm probably going to keep all of that in here just so it's all together because i don't have a big like box to keep in i have small jewelry boxes but they're actually full so i'm probably going to put that in here as well how many leopard print glasses does one girl need i'm actually embarrassed to say this isn't even all of them this is just the ones i've got out just all leopard print but i feel like they're all different so it's actually okay like these ones are bigger these ones different shape these ones not so noticeable these ones different shape these ones they've got the gold these are probably my favorite and the ones i've had for the longest i'm pretty sure these are actually only just primark as well i went through my camera roll the other day and i found a pair that i actually loved they were like this but a bit more rectangle and a bit bigger and they were like more of like a lighter leopard print which was really nice and i'm so sad because i don't think i've got them anymore or i don't know where they've gone um yeah these are all the sunglasses so i'm actually going to take a few more pairs probably going to try reduce it so i don't take all of these but just good to have options these are actually a couple of the bikinis i'm taking this is the first one i'm actually so excited to wear this but this is going to look so nice for tan it's just like this stripey striped triangle one and then i also like how it's both tie sides but sometimes i hate having tie sides especially when you're wearing like a tight cover up because i feel like these bits then just wobble at the side which i don't really like but i do have a pair of trousers that i can wear this bikini with i have this one which i've shown in a video anyways um but it's just again orange i feel like this with the tan is going to look so nice also a new one and probably my favorite i'm literally obsessed with this one um it's like this crochet again striped one triangle literally cannot wait to wear this one this is probably my favorite one out of all the ones to be fair, I haven't actually bought any, many, not any, but many new bikinis this year. I think I've probably got brought three or four, which is the ones I've just shown you. I think this one, which again is like similar to the orange one. It's like a Hunza G dupe. Um, it's like that crinkly material. Um, this is the bottoms. And then as you can see, the top is basically the exact same as the orange one. I'll just say this one's a bit smaller and more like... This one's more flexible, like stretchy and stuff. This one's obviously stretchy, but it's not like I don't really know how to explain it. This that this one just feels a bit like nicer. It's got padding as well, whereas this one's just like flat. Lastly, we have this one, which again is probably like my joint first, second favorite. It's just this cream one. It's actually upside down. It's just like this, and it's got the little flower, which I think is really cute. And then these the bottoms to match that, and again they've just got the flower on the side. I actually wanted to get this in black like these bits are black and then the flowers cream so it's kind of like contrast um, but they didn't actually have my size so i just went for the all cream one we have finally properly started we've got the case in here that's what this big thing in the way is kind of put it into piles now so i'm going to start by packing all of my cover-ups all of my cover-ups are beige beige brown and cream and white there is no color like literally zero colour in the cover-ups. There's colourful bikinis but not cover-ups. 
we have this skirt which is from the instagram brand jewel boutique i'll tag it these like linen -y crinkle trousers which are from bershka i then have a another crochet dress this is long sleeve um this is from the brand vanilla i think they actually sent me some pieces and this was one of the um things that they sent i then have this dress now i actually have a bikini that matches this but i can't find it right now i feel like my sister might have taken it um so i'm gonna wait for her to get home to see but it's just like this little really cute summer dress i actually got it well my friend we went to spain and i didn't pick it up when i was there and she was there for a few extra days so she picked it up for me because i was going to get it when i went to spain the first time then i didn't i don't know why i didn't um and then i was just going to get white i actually okay well this is like a cover-up and it's color i guess um but yeah packing cube going in this is all the cover-ups as you can see very basic very beige i am a beige person this is the progress so far i've got bikinis in here um cover-ups bags 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 more bikinis um nightwear another bag in the middle of packing things for like the daytime some more if i need a daytime outfit so i'm just doing things like shorts and tops and things like that um i've just added some more bits of jewelry into this bag it's actually very heavy um i also have that as like a bag the daytime or evening whatever i really need it for and then i also picked up this beach bag which i actually love um, I saw it in H&M a while ago and then I went back to get it because I loved it. I feel like it's really matching my top as well right now. Um, I just need to do sunglasses. I've put in some shoes. But I need to add some more. And then I actually don't like guys are going to think, what is she talking about? I don't have enough evening outfits. Like I ordered a few new things for the evening, but I didn't really order many things. So I'm now like, do I order some more things? Do I just see what I've got? But like, I don't really have anything that I feel like I want to take hey guys so i'm just fine my dog's watching me just finalizing packing a few hours till we fly well actually a couple hours till we fly it's 12 o'clock our flight is at nine this evening um so i'm just making sure i've got everything i need in my case um bags and everything here this is all for my case yesterday i weighed it i weighed it a few times first time i weighed it it was 19 weighed it a second time it was 24 weighed it a third time it was 21 weighed it fourth time fifth time i don't know what i said now it was 23 so i literally have no clue what the weight is um i've actually added a few more bits in so i'm a bit scared but i did take out my big bottle of like my cellar and stuff and added in more mini stuff um so hopefully that should be fine um but yeah, that is everything so far. I feel like I'm missing some things. I'm actually going to go pick up a bag for my friend Megan. She's going to lend me a bag for the airport. Because I do have bags, but they're not really like big enough. Well, they are. Like I have tote bags and stuff, but I kind of just wanted a bag. So she's going to lend me one. Um, so I'm going to go pick that up now and then pack my hand luggage like case. Um, that is basically everything. I'm just trying to think. I had a list of like makeup, like the pads cloth removers pajamas but they're both in i have a pair of sandals downstairs that i need to add and i think that's everything but i just feel like i'm really missing some things and now my battery is flashing so i'm going to go put this on charge so it's charged up before i go about to pack my airport bag i kind of got this from megan um we've got matching yeah they're basically the same anyway has got this in like beige so i'm just packing all the stuff in that i've got like my a few not toiletry bits but like liquidy bits um work phone my like laptop accessory bag it's got like batteries um sd cards some chargers and things in there i've just been downloading some things on my ipad because we have a seven hour flight this is like the longest flight that i've been on recently that i can remember some sunglasses wallet hairbrush I might wear my Apple Watch even though I don't really need it. This is then again like charges. I don't know whether to take this in my suitcase or this bag because it's already 
quite full and heavy. Have you actually packed your makeup? Yeah. Book. Makeup things again. That is practically full, so I might just have to leave it at that. Um, so yeah, that is my bag. I also don't know what I'm going to wear, but now that I've got this red bag, I might do... Oh, it's like burgundy. I might do my Tala leggings with a white top and then jumper. I just wish I had a white hoodie, but I don't have like a nice white hoodie. I've got sweatshirts, but I want a hoodie. I'm also probably just going to slick my hair back and wash it once we get there. Your Michelle Keegan hoodie. It's not white. Yeah, it's then let me just pack this wire as well. I don't really know what else I need to do. I need to just double check my case so I don't feel like I've got everything. I feel like I'm missing so much, but I don't know what. You have none of your makeup, like all your makeup bags. You're not good. I see all your good makeup. Bags. What good makeup? Like this, this, this. Your bobby brown. Yeah, I've got a small bobby brown, I've got powder puffs, I've got the dark elf um, thingy, I've got a true match foundation. I don't have enough weight in my case to overpack makeup. Also guys, I really want to show you the colour of my toes, but I don't really want to show you my toes. You said the slick backpack is gone. No, I didn't. I said the one I bought. Yeah, but I haven't seen that in ages. It was in your room the other day. So our dog's just gone off. She, well, she went a little while ago. She has gone to dog boarding. Um, and my mum cried, of course. But anyways, I'm going to end up the pack me and the other vlog here so that I can start a fresh one of a travel to Dubai.